A new lawsuit claims legendary football coach Bo Schembechler knew about the alleged sexual abuse by a University of Michigan doctor. Federal lawsuit was filed today by 50 accusers of the late Dr. Robert Anderson. It includes a football player who claims he told Schembechler about the abuse back in 1982. According to the suit, Schembechler advised the student to file a sexual abuse complaint with then athletic director Donald Canham, but Canham did nothing about it. Dr. Anderson worked at the university from the mid-1960s all the way through 2003 and died in 2008. Civil rights icon Congressman John Lewis has been laid to rest today. Family, friends and colleagues gathered in Atlanta today to celebrate Lewis's life and legacy. When he spoke, people listened. When he led, people followed. We loved him very much. He, he always saw the best in us. And he never gave up. And never stopped speaking out because he saw the best in us. Detroit natives B.B. and Marvin Winans led the congregation in singing We Shall Overcome. Representative Lewis died on July 17th at the age of 80 after a battle with cancer. Three former presidents and the House Speaker among those paying tribute to the man known as the conscience of Congress. Congressman Lewis buried next to his wife of more than 40 years, Lillian. She died back in 2012. All right, coming up, uh, Ben's talking about the rain, but uh, not with a whole lot of certainty, right, Ben?